Welcome to the New Japan Pro Wrestling Windy City Riot Press Conference. <laughs> I'm your host, Emily May, and tomorrow at the Wind Trust Arena, we will see epic battles premiering and streaming live on NJPW World Pay-Per-View starting at 7 p.m. Central. And we will also have a very special kickoff show starting on at 6.30 p.m. Central on NJPW World YouTube channel. You don't want to miss that. And for the media members present here today, there are no interviews or questions at this time. So to get started, we will begin with the Riot Rules match. <laughs> Introducing first, please welcome the current strong open weight champion, Mad King, Eddie Kingston. <laughs> Hey, what's up? Yeah. I will. Okay. <laughs> and uh, introducing next, please welcome War Ready Gabe Kid. Come on then, what are you going to say to me then? Uh, Eddie, I, I think we'll start with your comments. Uh, what's your thoughts about the Riot Rules match tomorrow? I, I have no thoughts. I'm just going to go and fuck him up. That's really what you're going to say. Come on, what you, what you really got on your mind? What you got to say to these people? These people traveled a long way. Multi-states, different countries. What you got to say? Come on, what you got to say to build this match? What you got to say to me? I'm sat right build, here. I don't have to build I'm nothing. sat right here. What you got to say to me? I ain't got to build nothing, bro. What you got to say to me? What do you mean? I ain't got to build nothing. What you got to say to me? It's you know what I mean? Go on, say You know what I got to say to you? you? Who did you text when you were going through your shit? Who did you text? Who do you text, my I text you. February right. 2022, I text That's you. Right. And I helped you, and then you go join Bully Club, and now you become this piece of shit. And now you're trying to come at me? Now you're trying to come at me? You got no heart, dog. You got no trust, no heart. You ain't nah, a man of your word. You ain't got no heart. You ain't, you no ain't got no respect for this shit. This is New Japan Pro Wrestling. Yeah, I know where the fuck you are. You turned up to a press conference in a fucking baseball jersey. How are you talking about you respect this shit? Yeah, yeah. How are yeah, you yeah. talking about you respect this yeah. shit? You are finished tomorrow. You are what finished tomorrow. Are you I'm not even waiting for a do? title match. Oh, I'm yeah. Like, I'm going to end your career tomorrow. I'm going to break your neck. I'm going to break your neck. Let's go. Thank you, Eddie and Gabe, I guess. Uh, I guess that's a preview of the Riot Rules match tomorrow. Whew. Uh, we're going we're gonna to reset. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you, gentlemen. Um, 
for helping us reset. Um, we'll, we'll get this we'll get this cleaned up real quick and uh, continue with our press conference. Apologies, everyone uh, who's watching. Uh, as a reminder, you can watch Windy City Riot on NJPW World Pay Per View live at 7 p.m. Central. I think we're we're ready to continue. All right. Uh, we, we are going to continue with a special singles match. First, please welcome Stone Pitbull Tomohiro Ishii. Yeah. Next, please welcome the current IWGP Global Heavyweight Champion, the Wanted Man, Nick Nemeth. Oh Let's start with Ishii. Please let us know your thoughts on tomorrow's special singles match. Nick Nemes. Now, I'm not going to be a man. I'm not going to be a man. I'm not going to be a Nick Nemeth has had a completely opposite path in wrestling to mine. Masani any kind I don't know elite course or yunde. Mafsu datara uh majuaru has no knife tariga koste onaji sekini tski shabedi so she ashta tatakaru majinse wakan ne monde. Uh, he's had a rocket strapped to his back and been on an elite course, but uh, it's it's an interesting facet of life that here we are today to be sat here in the same press conference and be able to share the same thoughts. Nemes ga pro wrestling jinsei dai ni shou ni shin nihon o yarabi, so shite so kou de ippatsu de belt o totta, ma sugei wa na, hakki yutte, ma so yu hoshi no moto ni umarete kitan daro. Uh, but Nick chose New Japan Pro Wrestling to begin his second life in professional wrestling and immediately on his debut took a championship and that's a, that's an incredible achievement. But even though he's in his second chapter of his career, it's only had one page written in it so far. And the second page is open tomorrow because Nick hasn't experienced Japanese professional wrestling. He hasn't seen it, he hasn't felt it, he hasn't tasted it, and won't until tomorrow. So tomorrow, I'll make sure that Tomohiro Ishii is very prominent in that second chapter of his career. Thank you, Ishii. Next, Nick, please tell us your thoughts and response. Um, first and foremost, um, I am in the middle of starting a brand new chapter of my life. Um, I'm the happiest and healthiest I've ever been and I would say even smartest in the ring at the moment. Um, I grew up watching wrestling, and I'll make this quick because I don't want to waste anyone's time. I grew up watching wrestling at five years old, and I turned to my dad and I said, I'm going to do that. And 
someone at my size, even at five, he said that might be an obstacle, but let's, let's start you in wrestling. So at five years old, I started. And I said, I'm going to do this until I become a professional wrestler. It doesn't matter how big I am. It doesn't matter if I have friends in the business, if I'm a legacy. It doesn't matter who the boss is, who's in charge. I'm going to find a way to make it. <clears throat> so somehow, after making my way through starting wrestling at five years old, wrestling at St. Ed's, to St. Edward Wrestling in high school, two-time world, two-time national champions with some world champions on our team, Olympians, and awesome, awesome national champions all over individually in college. I got to be in that room, and I was okay, but I was getting better every day knowing that once I got out of St. Ed's, if I made it to college, I would be walking on, so again, on my own, walking on to a school, Division I, with one goal in mind, breaking the all-time wins record just to have a chance that any boss in professional wrestling who has a company could Google my name and say, this guy wants it more than anybody else. I graduated from Kent State Division I, the all-time winningest wrestler, purely to become a pro wrestler. So there's nothing quick, lightning, rocket, you name all those words, those don't happen to me, and I wouldn't have it any other way. I look forward to this match, this special challenge match. One, because I know what Ishii can do. I've seen the footage. I know the deal. And he's absolutely right. You need to be in the match with him one-on-one -on -one, to feel New Japan Pro Wrestling, to actually feel just the emotion and the vibes and everything that's in that ring standing across from him. I watched the tapes. I famously don't watch wrestling. I watched Ishii tapes. I know this is big. I know what this means for me. I know that walking into New Japan, one match and becoming champion, I know what that means. I know what people are saying behind my back. I completely understand it too because I would have said the same thing. You have to be able to back it up. The target's on your back. The hard work starts now. And then it starts now the next time. I look forward to this match more than anything because, one, I know how hard he can hit. That's why I want this match. I know what he can do. I know what he's capable of. I've seen the clotheslines. I've seen the headbutts. I've seen the tackles. I know it. He said I didn't feel it. I haven't felt it in person, but I sure as hell felt it through my phone and my iPad. I'm ready for it. I am absolutely ready. Look at this jaw. I can take a punch. I can take a kick. I can take a headbutt. What I look forward to most is not just proving myself, being in the ring with a legend like him. Ishii's fantastic. I'm a fan. Watching the tapes, I've become a fan. And now in this special challenge match, I really look forward to not being so nice, not being so complimentary, not saying how great he is, not saying what a legend he is, not standing across from him and just, wow, this is so cool to be in in the ring with him, because it is. The second that bell rings, all of that goes out the window. There's a reason over 19 to 20 years, I become a self-made rocket strapped on my back professional wrestler, because I have survived no matter what has been thrown my way. I look forward to this match because it's not a challenge, it's more than that. It's huge, it's big, it's my chance to show everyone in New Japan and around the world what I am capable of. I am the best to do this job in my mind all over the world for the last 10 years straight and I won't stop, maybe 10, maybe 20 more. I do what I do better than anyone else in this business and you better bet your ass I'm gonna do the exact same thing tomorrow and win and I will be proud of it. Thank you. Thank you, Nick. Um, now we will move forward for a photo in the center of the room. If you can please both step forward.
Thank you, Ishii and Nick. That is all for the special singles match. Next is the IWGP World Heavyweight Championship. <laughs> Introducing first, please welcome the challenger, Death Rider John Moxley. <laughs> Next, please welcome the eighth IWGP World Heavyweight Champion, Tetsuya Naito. <laughs> Let's start with the challenger. John Moxley, please tell us your thoughts about tomorrow's championship match. I've been lining up this shot like a sniper for five years. And now all the conditions are right and the target is in my sights. And tomorrow night, I pull the trigger, and in situations like this, where there is no room for error and the game is on the line, I do not miss. 2019, when I came into New Japan Pro Wrestling for the first time, my feet hit that blue mat. A monster was created. Something different was created. And a lot of, a lot of competitors in New Japan thought it was some kind of joke, thought it was some kind of publicity stunt, like I couldn't compete on the IWGP championship level, this guy found out that it wasn't no joke. And now five years later, the John Moxley of 2024 is way better than the John Moxley of 2019. Way more dangerous in every conceivable way. Nobody puts the work in outside of the ring like I do. God didn't give me much, but nobody works as hard as I do. Nobody studies and trains as hard as I do for moments like this. For moments like tomorrow night right here in Chicago. And Naito. Me and, me, me and Naito aren't too different, actually. We're very different, but we're a lot the same in a lot of ways. I know things about Naito. I understand Naito in a way Sonata didn't, in a way Yorosuji didn't the other night in Ryugoku. I understand that you're going to have to run him down to the ends of the earth. I understand that Naito is better when his back is against the wall, when he's cornered like an animal. And right now he is cornered like an animal. He is going to be in danger tomorrow night and he knows what can happen because I've beaten him before. I know exactly what it's gonna take and how long it's gonna take. And I'm prepared to put in many hours as it takes, as many minutes as it takes, as many miles as I gotta run to run him down to the end of the earth until he stops moving. This is like the immovable force versus the unstop uh, unstoppable object versus the immovable force, but kind of different. It's like two, <laughs> two indestructible entities, two pieces of shoe leather that will just have to get beaten and beaten and beaten until one of them loses its, is it loses its integrity tomorrow night. It's gonna be a long night. And I'm prepared for it. Thank you very much, John. Uh, next, the champion Naito. Please tell us your thoughts and response. 
Hola amigos, ¿cómo estás? Bien, 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 todo bien. Los ingobernables de Japón, Naito de Tsea des. Mazuwa, Mazuwa, Coco Chicago ni IWGP, Sekai Heavy Q Champion to Ste, Coreta Goto, Sgok Ureskumimas. Ashta, Taisen Sir John Moxley Senshu des Ga, Coco ni Single Match of Sakoto Ga, Arimasta. Nisen Juku ne, Shigat Nijo Hatinichi, Aich Ken Tekan. その時俺は敗れているわけでやっとあの時のリベンジをする時が来ましたしかもアメリカでリベンジできるということでこんな嬉しいことはないし加齢的にもこんな屈辱的なことはないでしょう早くリングに立ちたいですがそこはトランキーロ焦らずに明日ゴングが鳴るその瞬間を楽しみにしたいと思います。So first of all, I'm happy to be here with the IWGP World Heavyweight Championship.、Uh, we have faced one another once before, as John Moxley said back in 2019 in the summer in Aichi, and he did beat me that night. So I'm very happy for the chance to get my revenge and to do it on John Moxley's home turf in America. That's something that couldn't make me happier and something that wouldn't, you couldn't think of something more painful for John Moxie to experience.、Um, <laughs> so,、uh, you know, I, I'd really want to go right now. I can't wait. I'm very excited, but、uh, I'm going to stay tranquilo and relax <laughs> and get ready for tomorrow night's main event. We will now move on to the official contract signing. John Moxley, you will sign first. And now we will, if you,、uh, both of you can move towards the center of the room, we will take a short photo.
for joining us for the New Japan Pro Wrestling Windy City press conference. We will be streaming live on NJPW World pay-per-view exclusively in English starting at 7 p.m. Central at the Wind Trust Arena. And don't forget, we have the special kickoff matches on the NJPW World YouTube channel starting at 6.30 p.m. Central. We can't wait to see you at Windy City Riot. Woo!